Taurus, you guys, I've got just got the fun doing pulling your energy. There is somebody who is sneaky, secretive, and hiding. This has caused somebody to become very drained, tired, and exhausted. There is an energy that is surrounding you of wanting, thinking, and yearning, okay? So somebody wants you. They're thinking about you. They're yearning you. You want them. You're thinking about them. Or you're yearning them, okay? But somebody's been very secretive and sneaky somewhere in this dynamic here. And this has really drained somebody, okay? Like, it's really taking the air out of somebody, okay? It's dealing with this, okay? Um, somebody's called a gut judgment shot. It really just is that simple. Somebody is saying, I choose not to deal with this person anymore. They're trying to solve a problem. They're awakening to this secretive, sneaky, hiding behavior. Um, they are uh, possibly in trouble, uh, with the law, they may be going to court. There is definitely a change of status that is here, possibly a reunion or a transformation. I love you too, honey. Um, Virgo Taurus Capricorn is here. There is somebody here that is grounded, okay? Um, either you're dealing with another Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn is in your energy. Um, but there is somebody here that is showing up mature. So show, look, showing up mature, Taurus, okay? I ain't pulled. This is starter energy. Y'all know me, okay? We're going to get to it, all right? But they're showing up right now as mature, okay? Um, grounded even, okay? Um, healing, intellectually successful, okay? Um, somebody's got on. Somebody has walked away. Somebody has uh, traveled. Maybe they, uh, you know, travel is what they do possibly. But nonetheless, there's has been withdrawn here. Somebody's very disappointed here. Um, somebody feels a lack of importance. And somebody also has uh, reached somebody's limit here, okay? There is a situation to where, for some of you guys, this um, Eight of Pentacles is damn sure going to mean a new job. It's damn sure going to mean mastery. It's damn sure going to mean entrepreneurship, ambition, preparation, expertise, paying attention to detail, ingenuity, focus, and uh, dedicated. But... And, and that will be true for some of you guys, okay? This job may be at a distance with this Eight of Cups, all right? Somebody might have to leave, travel, travel maybe with the dude, got to relocate, whatever, to, for this job, okay? Or possibly even school. But this feels more to me like preparation, all right? It feels like you need to be preparing for something. We'll dig into that. Now, with this energy of the wanting, the thinking, and the yearning, um, this is either a friendship. Um, this is somebody who has somebody has serious ass memories with. Um, it's a bond, all right, you guys? Um, it could be your ex. It really could be. Um, but nonetheless, somebody definitely is, is going down memory lane, you know, if nothing else. But what it does feel like to me is that they want to mend something here. OK, they want to get something going. All right. In this here situation. At the end of the day, what I see here is that I feel like you want some peace. I feel like you want some peace, some harmony, some flow, some serenity, tranquility, contentment, you know, um, balance and just woosa. OK, like. Just some peace. All right. Um, let me let me dig into this energy a little bit so I can get more of a feel here. Because like I said, somebody is secretive, sneaking and hiding. Somebody is drained, tired or exhausted. And somebody definitely is yearning. Now, this could be you, Taurus. OK. Or this could be somebody, you know, that you're dealing with. All right. Let's see. Secretive, sneaky, not hiding. Something is, like I said, laws here, all right? For some of you guys, the law will definitely be here. Um, and for others of you, this is an imbalance, all right? Somebody feels definitely imbalanced in this situation. Um, they feel feel like they're uh, this has been unfair, this uh, secretive, sneaky, and uh, hiding. Somebody's drained, you guys. They're tired. They're exhausted. They're exhausted of this deception, all right? Somebody loves. There's a lot of emotions here. A good and bad, okay? Because I got deception versus temptation. So where somebody is very tempting, there is also an energy of a lot of uh, emotions here. Um, but somebody feels deception. Somebody There's deception around this energy and somebody's just trying, uh, drained and tired on so many levels. Being tempted by them, having emotions by them, different coming and going. And also the... Um, the deception that they're bringing so somebody is definitely need to make a decision when it comes down to wanting thinking and craving your yearning wanting thinking craving yearning okay either you're wanting somebody somebody's wanting you uh somebody's thinking about you you're thinking about somebody and somebody is yearning vice versa puzzle pieces but somebody definitely do need to make a decision okay now like i said before for some of you guys the truth is going to be that there is a court case here okay um but for others of you this is just solving a problem okay now this can be reunion and solving a problem all right um, but at the same time, this also could be a change of status, which is leaving somebody alone. Okay. Judgment call. All right. Um, but what I feel is, is that there's a stalemate here for some of you guys. Somebody is avoiding something here. We will dig. 
but there's some some type of avoidance going on here somebody's at a distance somebody walked away somebody ghosted um somebody withdrew they pulled their energy back somebody became closed off guard and resistant somebody is very much so suffering because of this okay somebody left somebody dipped okay they walked away all right they abandoned the situation they withdrew pulled their energy back okay somebody feels a lack of important and disappointed somebody has become closed off guard and resistant and somebody is suffering behind this okay suffering meaning they're sad and also once again there's a lot of emotions here okay somebody wants to mend this there's a lot of mental agility going on there's a lot of thoughts this could have been a wonderful perfect friendship um this was a wonderful perfect friendship at one particular time somebody has become detached and cold all right um so we do got a virgo towards capricorn here this could be you okay or you could be dealing with another earth sign all right you guys check out the collective reading as well because the collective reading is not is not just for the signs that i don't do okay like some of the fire in the um air in some of the water signs it is also for you guys as well it's going to be more pieces to this puzzle okay if you look at the collective as well okay you guys so listen somebody's expression their truth okay it's just that simple they're, 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 they're getting real truthful and honest with themselves at this particular time. Yes, there's emotions here. Yes, there's chemistry here. And yes, there's passion. But there's also getting to the money. There's also some, some type of success that somebody has on their mind. Um, there is definitely somebody who is very down to earth. They're practical. They're not allowing these emotions to override them. Okay? And that's even if they have these emotions, you guys. You know... It, I don't know. It's a lot of deception here. You know what I'm saying? Maybe they did at one time. You know what I'm saying? So for those of you that's getting a new job, there's some type of limitations that's going on in this ambition, this entrepreneurship um, school, possibly. There could be fears because there may be a, ch a change of status as far as job is concerned. Maybe somebody is having a hard time, you know, with a learning curve or whatever the case may be. Somebody is limited here. But when it comes down to preparing for something somebody damn sure need to be preparing for some type of walls to be thrown up either they need to be preparing for some walls to be thrown up or you need to be preparing for some walls to be thrown up because somebody has some boundaries here okay they're not meant to be crossed all right it really just is that simple and somebody's fearful of these boundaries but at the end of the day, what somebody wants is peace. Temperance is here. So at the end of the day, that's all somebody wants, okay? Somebody definitely does think about this a lot, all right? They, they're thinking about their serenity. They're thinking about their tranquility. They're thinking about their commitment. They're calm. Yeah, they're very emotional. Somebody's definitely emotional. There's some Cancer Pisces Scorpio somewhere in somebody's chart here um, or your person, all right? So let's go ahead and let's get some more. Let's glean. Let me glean some more information here. Okay. You guys, I am using um, my for your starter energy. I am using my deck sip with Nikki on situations. Um, it is available. And also this one that I will be gleaning more information from is called the naked truth. It is a high priestess deck. It has 130 cards, you guys. And plus it does have karma cards inside. All right. Um, and that is also available. If you guys want um, this, any one of these decks, including uh, well, if you're trying to go, you can get a dish of one of my tarot decks. But um, yeah, look in the about box for my email, you guys, or description. You'll see my email, okay? Um, but let me get a few of these here so we can kind of glean a little bit more of what's going on here. Taurus, I hope everybody is doing good today. Okay, that's y'all. It's a whole lot of stuff coming out. Y'all going through a lot. Okay, that's just what I know. All right, for all these cards to be coming out like this. All right, let's see here. Let me get these together. Read these to you. We're going to get into the tarot. All right, you guys. Um, so, what we have here is. Somebody is meeting and building bonds with others, meeting and building bonds with others. OK, we got conflicted decisions. Somebody is conflicted with some decisions here. OK, um, somebody wants to be seen, y'all. Somebody wants some attention. All right. Somebody needs somebody's attention. They want to be seen. OK, um, or they want other people's attention. Be careful. We'll use whatever to get what they want. Be careful. We'll use whatever they they. Be careful. We'll use whatever to get what they want. OK. They are turned back and confused. This is a karma card, you guys. 
Somebody's going to be receiving karma. All these cards does not necessarily have to resonate with each and every one of you. Some of these will resonate with some of you. Some of them won't resonate with others of you, okay? But anyway, nonetheless, love destroyed here, okay, you guys? Puzzle pieces. Um, They sleep around and they are for everybody. Sleep around and they're for everybody, all right? Somebody is embarrassed and ashamed. Embarrassed and ashamed, you guys. Um, They go out of their way to hide the truth. This is that sneaky shit right here, okay? That hiding, secretive, you know, sneaky shit. They go out their way to hide the truth, y'all, okay? Um, you know the third party. You know the third party, all right? Um, they want to talk to you. Somebody wants to talk to you, Taurus. You want to talk to them, vice versa. They are weak-minded and uh, easy. They are weak-minded and easy, okay? Somebody don't like that about somebody. I feel they want to fight or attack. This is another high priestess card. Somebody is this inner this high priestess is saying they feel like somebody wants to attack. They're getting very angry, okay? Um, emotions is starting to flare up. Like I said, I got a lot of emotions here already. Yeah, a lot of emotions. And also a lot of getting to the money, okay? So it's almost like for some of you guys with all these cups and pinnacles, I feel like, you know, if you're not able to deal with the person who you're with, I feel like somebody's indulging in maybe, you know, getting to some money here, okay? So with that being said, shout out day ones, VIPs, community members. I love you guys to death. You guys join Train to Go. That's my community membership. There's a lot of perks, a lot of sign-on bonuses, okay, you guys? Um, so I would love to have you there. All right. If you guys are new or recent to the channel, please go in the comment section below. Let me know that you're new. That way I can give you a warm welcome that you definitely do deserve. I have a hands-on relationship with a lot of my subscribers. Just let themselves be known to me. And I would love to have the same relationship with you as well. Okay. So also remember for every 100 new subscribers, somebody will get a free read. Taurus, I've already prayed over these clarifiers. Okay. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Absolutely, positively no other. Okay. I've asked for truth. Revelation, confirmation, guidance, consolation, peace, and protection as I give Jesus Christ, Yeshua, Messiah, all the praise, the honor, and the glory, okay? And on this channel, that is the only one that gets all the honor, the praise, and the glory, okay? So with that being said, we got somebody secret here. We got an imbalance here that's going on, okay? Some type of unfairness is going on. Somebody might be in a court, all right? But nonetheless, you know, I'm just saying, this is a very sneaky, you know, weasel-like energy, Got something to do with love, okay? Maybe somebody wants this person. Um, this could possibly be uh, a reuniting. Maybe they want to get together. Maybe you just got with this person. These cups can be new love, okay? But it also can be a reuniting as well, okay? Somebody possibly, this could be a third party situation. They're sneaking in, hiding a third party situation, okay? Holy Spirit, give more. Yeah, somebody using mind over matter, mind over emotions, okay? Somebody is listening to their instincts. Which is a damn good thing. Becoming fearless and brave. Give me drain, tired, and exhausted. Somebody's tired of this deceptive, tempting motherfucker. They just are, okay? Because we're dealing with a liar, a stealer, a killer, a cheater, a thief, a fake, a phony, okay? Somebody who does does definitely have a lack of conscience. And somebody is draining them. You know, this is an energy vampire, basically, okay? Um, tell me what they lied about, though. What what, what is they what what is this mask? Love. Okay. Giving love. What are they doing? Cancer Pisces Scorpio is here. Just pulled up. They're acting single. Okay, you guys. So why they sitting up here with somebody? For some of you, the truth will be that they're out here acting single. All right. Um, but somebody is wanting. Okay, somebody is wanting you, thinking about you, yearning, or vice versa. Somebody got a decision to make. Holding tight. Taurus. This feels like you. Okay. It is four pinnacles. It does represent Taurus. All right. So I'm just saying. Um, but anyway, it don't have to be you that's wanting somebody and yearning somebody, but it could be. What well, Holy Spirit, give me more. Third party situation. Somebody's in separation. Somebody's heartbroken, okay? Severe heartbreak is here, all right? Somebody wants to talk. Taurus, you, them, okay? Got everything to do with this separation. Got everything to do with this heartbreak and, and disillusion, okay? This upheaval. This emotional upheaval, this having a whole emotional funeral, somebody wants to talk, okay? Um, but there is court here. And there also is avoiding this conversation. There's avoiding calling a shot. There's avoiding a change of status. For some of you, that will be true. It don't matter how much somebody avoids this, okay? Because bottom line is the world is here, all right? So with that being said, there's going to be a change, whether somebody wants it or not, okay? Good change, bad change. Something coming to completion. Holy Spirit, can you tell me more, please? For your sons and your daughters. Somebody's moving on. Okay? Moving on. Now, they could be moving on to your direction. 
or they can move on to some other. It feels like it is, all right, you guys. Even though Nine of Cups came out sideways, I mean, this still is relationships. This is which is granted. This is comfort and comfortability. This is familiarity, okay. This is abundance, all right. Stability, living well, okay. What I'm saying is, this ain't no broke individual. Somebody dealing with, okay. So. Eight of Cups, so somebody don't walk away, okay? Somebody don't reach their damn limit. Somebody's getting tired of being blindsided. They're full of fear. They're full of anxiety. Whoever this person is, they keep getting blindsided. It's full of things. Even victimized, y'all. Somebody could have put somebody's hands on something. Could be a dude or if you always say this, y'all, because females jump on dudes too, okay? So that could be it. Somebody may be in jail. Somebody constantly, possibly could, you know, always get in trouble here. Uh, so they may be locked up right now with this here Eight of Cups. Nonetheless, somebody is suffering. Somebody does feel bad about this. And on top of that, this has really caused a lot of doubt. It's casted a lot of doubt over this relationship. Somebody's closed off guard of resistance. Is it you, Taurus? Are you the one that's closed off your guard and resistant? Yeah, because you got a situation to where somebody doesn't want some bullshit anymore. It really just is that simple, okay? Somebody's like, you wasted my time. Really, for real. Regretful comparison. You know what I'm saying? Like, honestly, somebody feels that way. So, yeah, there's a lot of detachment. Somebody's suffering because somebody don't want somebody no more. Definitely. Too many games being played. Justice here. Somebody definitely in legal problems. Somebody got warrants, y'all. There is a warrant here if somebody is arrest, all right? Um, there's legal problems. Somebody definitely does want to mend this, or at least they're thinking about it a lot. Okay, they want to get on the same page with somebody here. They want somebody. They want this family. Told you they ain't messing with nobody broke. Told you that. Okay. So this is stability here. This is ten of pentacles. Okay. This is you know with this nine of cups to this ten of pentacles. That means we have a baller in the house. All right. I don't know who that will resonate for. But doesn't really matter because somebody doesn't know if they're gonna have it or not. They're, 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 you know, got you know, illusions and delusions, okay? They don't know. What, what's going to happen, Holy Spirit? Healing is here. But, hey, they got to want to heal. You see how chick got her back turned to this other chick? They got to want to heal, y'all. Okay? It's just that simple. It boils down to that. How much self-improvement is one willing to make? Because, honestly, with this moon card and her back is turned to this here star, it lets me know. And the blindfolds on this one, too. The person can take the blindfolds at any time. Fear is keeping them from taking these blindfolds off, okay? Illusions and delusions. Somebody wanting to live in the lie. Somebody wants to cast this upon somebody else. Her back is turned to the star. This is where the rubber meets the road. Is it going to work? Is it not going to work? Until that person turns around to the star and wants some healing, wants, you know, things to get off the ground, you know, and um, take upon whatever bright opportunity is in front of them and actually do some work. I wouldn't mind, see, I wouldn't be surprised if I see Hangman because I do feel like somebody is in limbo. You know, this is not going to take off, okay? Children may be involved. Somebody may possibly be at a distance. Childhood wounds, PTSD, need somebody to talk to, AANA, not from there where somebody is originally from, travels back and forth, travel again, maybe what they do, a lot of water in their chart. Somebody is thinking about leaving past long, okay? Somebody needs to recover from the abuse, mental, physical, spiritual, whatever, okay? There is love here, definitely. There is the Queen of Cups is here, y'all. So rather you dealing with a Cancer Pisces Scorpio or not, Queen of Cups represents love. So there is love here. Some, so this is the case for some of you guys that no matter how much somebody loves somebody, they have to call a shot, okay? Because they can't deal with this lying. They can't deal with this stealing, this killing, this cheating, this, this unbalanced ass shit. They can't deal with third party situations. They can't deal with this deception. They can't deal with emotions all over the place. They cannot deal with any more heartbreak, any more closed off, guarded, and resistant. And they cannot deal with any more detachment, being called, avoiding something, and fucking up this here family or this here which is granted or stability. So what this feels like is I love you, but you've given me no choice, okay? You've given me no choice but to turn my back on you, okay? That's what that is. That's going to be the truth for some of y'all, okay? All right, so let's see. Some of y'all got a new job coming up, all right? But you need to be getting prepared for some as well, all right? So I'm about to be having two different storylines for you in just one second, okay? So when it comes down to this new job, for some of you guys, y'all done got into it with somebody. You got a supervisor, you got a manager who feel like they own the fucking company, okay? So y'all done got into it with somebody for some of you guys. There's friction and conflict with coworkers who, um, you know, is, I don't know, y'all, what they be doing. Y'all, I really just don't, but... 
you know how your co-workers be okay um yeah you got some of y'all got some of them okay so there is a situation to where somebody is limited there is a fear factor here because like i said there's a manager a supervisor or something that feels like they own the damn company all right and how they handle their workers is real real foul okay so somebody might have snapped on that on them in some type of way shape fashion or form or somebody's like you know what i just go find me somewhere somewhere else you see what i'm saying too much friction going on. But you need to prepare also for this five of wands. You need to prepare for somebody coming at you. You need to prepare for family and friends getting up in somebody's business. Bumping heads, opposition, ego clashing, okay? When it comes down to this marriage, this twin flame, soulmate connection, somebody is in the military here, okay? Or was. Um, but yeah, there's limits, limitations here when it comes down to this love, okay? Somebody's fearful. It's a whole bunch of cards I want to know. Holy Spirit. I just need one, please. Thank you. Crosswatcher Energy Cannon will get involved. Crosswatcher, I want you guys to know that I love Crosswatcher just like I love Taurus. If this is a Taurus that's done this to you, please go in the comment section below. Let me know because I am very interested to know how energy interchanges. And you will be helping me out an awful lot. Uh, Crosswatcher, I love you dearly, okay? Like, share, and subscribe. And you are always welcome here, okay? Somebody crying real tears, okay, behind this union. Somebody having a whole emotional funeral, y'all. Somebody is really, really concentrating on loss, all right? I don't know. Just you, them. I don't know, okay? But somebody is, all right? Um, You know, somebody feels abandoned, all right? Somebody feels a lot of grief, a lot of loss. This is a haunting loss. Somebody is flirting with somebody else here as well. That's what you need to be prepared for as well. Or a cross watcher, okay? They go mode, y'all. It's just that simple. They're go mode, all right? They're going to get what they want, okay? It's just that simple. They're going to get what they want. Regardless if it's this situation or the next situation, they're going to get what they want, okay? Um, Give me temperance. Yeah, somebody been wanting this for a while. Like, that's all they want here, okay, you guys? At the end of the day... Really, to be honest, that's all somebody wants here is this tranquility, this contentment, this moderation, this serenity, this calm, this patience. They don't want to be scared anymore. They want balance, balance, harmony, flow. All right. They want their emotions. Somebody is really emotional about somebody here. It's, it's too much water here. Oh, this very more. This roguishness, this extra being um, fearless in external events, toxicity, you know, this shit got to change. Okay. So if this is you or if this is somebody around you that is bringing external toxicity, you know, fearless in their toxic ass ways, their childish ass behavior, you know, if that is what somebody's bringing to you, this is saying that the only way you're going to get your peace and your harmony is to leave that person alone. OK, and very quickly. All right. Not a sorts. All right. You need to whatever exit you there is, if somebody is bringing this drama, OK, this uh, drugs, alcohol, you know, addictions of all kind of sort, the lying, the abuse, the toxicity, the conflict, the avoidance, the ego clashing, the obstacles, third party situations, the, um, you know, heartbreak, illusions and delusions. You know, this off balance, being closed off guard and resistant. Listen, somebody here needs to hurry up and lead this situation along. Night, night of sorts lead this in, in, in because the only thing that's going to happen is y'all fixing to hit the tower, okay? So you keep on messing with this person. You might have already hit the tower, okay? Something may have happened very, very fast. Something blew up in somebody's face very, very fast. Puzzle pieces, y'all, okay? But love blew up somebody's face, okay? Somebody don't like it. This is the reason why somebody yarning and wanting and carrying on, okay? Somebody crying real tears. Damage has been done, okay? Or will be. If somebody does keeps on going down, you know, this route. Right. See, this is burden. Heavy burden. Somebody's ready to put this burden down, okay? They understand that somebody cannot be up and up on the up and up with them they bought their money you guys it really just is that simple they're about to be you know going off the big beaten path to get to this money especially with this page of you know this is a lot of socialization y'all this is networking you know what i'm saying and yeah. collaborating networking socializing meetups meet and greets 
you know, looking for bright opportunities, looking for whatever door to be open. Somebody's about to go off the beaten path with this. All right. Somebody's about to forge their own way for this here Ace of Pentacles because they want some more money. OK, they want to live a certain kind of way. They want stability. You guys, they want, you know, to invest. They want they do want the, the love. But it's almost like, you know what, if I can't have it, then what I will do is I'll have what I want to have in every other area. OK, so. um yeah, let me see. Let me tell you guys. Let me read these to you again so you guys can kind of see what's going on in here. Like I said, for some of this is going to apply to you. Some of it don't. Okay. So somebody is meeting and building bonds with others. Meeting and building bonds with others. Okay. Um, I feel they want to fight or attack. Somebody's getting angry here. I don't know. Okay. Maybe it's the walls somebody's built. I don't know. They are very weak minded and easy. Very weak minded, very easy. Okay. Um, they will, uh, they want to talk to you, Taurus. They won't talk to you. You won't talk to them. Somebody won't talk to somebody. You know the third party. For those of you that is dealing with this third party situation, you know them. Okay. They go out of their way to hide the truth. Yeah, because you're dealing with a hidey, sneaky, you know, individual. Okay. Um, Embarrassed or ashamed. Somebody's embarrassed and ashamed. All right. Embarrassed or ashamed. They sleep around. They are for everybody. They sleep around. They are for everybody. Love is destroyed. Love is destroyed. They are turned back and confused. This is a karma card, you guys. For some of you, your person, you going to be getting karma. Be careful. We'll use whatever to get what they want. Be careful. We'll use whatever to get what they want. This person wants to be seen. They want attention. Okay. They want your attention or everybody else's attention. Something like that. Okay. But nonetheless, there's confliction here and decisions definitely do need to be made. Okay. So let me go ahead and um, give you guys who's on this here table. We got Scorpio. Gemini is here, Sagittarius here, uh, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio is here. You guys check out the collective. You may get some more pieces, okay? Um, Sagittarius here, Libra is here. Definitely court for some of you guys. Somebody's tired of being blind to this here, true. Somebody's tired of being blindsided, period, okay? Aquarius, Pisces, Gemini, Taurus, you're here. Cancer Pisces, Scorpio. A lot of, a lot of water here, y'all. Gemini. Somebody damn sure wants this here love. They want it. They want it bad. Okay. Um, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Sagittarius. Yep. And a lot of water, y'all. It's a lot of... This card is water. And all I got is cups and pentacles, y'all. I mean, I got some wines, but I'm just saying. You know, this is a lot of emotions here. It's almost like can't deal with the emotions. I'm going to go get to my money. That's That's what it feels like, okay? Um, so this is what I have for you. Hopefully I was able to put one piece together for you. If I was, that means I've definitely done my job. I'd appreciate it if you like, share, subscribe, Taurus. I love you guys to death. See you soon.